Hi there, it's Snorkel. Welcome back to my playthrough of To the Moon. This is a lovely, it, it's in the style of a classic RPG game, but uh, it's not really an RPG game. Very narrative driven, and um, currently there's, a, there's an old man who was on his deathbed, has a couple of days to live, and we're, we're playing as two doctors who work for a company that can supposedly grant him a wish. Now, he's, he is unconscious. He's, he's unable to communicate. I'm not sure how, what that looks like or how that works, but that's part of the discovery process of this game. So far, the game is really delightful. Uh, very snappy dialogue. The dialogue is fantastic. So let's go ahead and play. Last time we left off, there was a these two children, these two children, are showing us around uh, and they said we should go to the lighthouse because we might learn more about this character from the lighthouse. Hey, hold on. What's over there? Oh, this. What is that? In memory of River E. Wiles. River Wiles. Was she John's wife? Don't know. Come on. The lighthouse is right there. Hmm. Okay. Let's go in. So we know that his wife died a couple of years before him. Nothing much down here that we can interact with, so I guess let's just head upstairs. We're trying to find, wow, all the way up. Boy, you'd get your steps in living here, wouldn't you? And more, yes, more of these rabbits. So we, so we saw, um, we saw, we saw, um, a uh, the room in the basement that was locked that had the same thing. A bunch of rabbits and a music box. That's interesting. Uh, oh yeah, Johnny must have come here before he fell ill again. <laughs> this is the only one with two colors. Hmm? You know, these things actually look pretty hard to fold. Kind of an odd hobby though. Oh, that's my phone. It's Watts. Is everything ready? All right, I'll be right there. Why do you have a creepy ringtone? Because it scares the monsters away. Come on, let's head back. Received. Paper rabbit. Okay. Thank goodness they don't make us walk back. Now's where it fades in to make us walk back. Okay, here we go. So this is my partner over here. Uh, I guess that's my partner. That, this is the machine. Okay, why don't we late by another half an hour? Not like we've got a dying client or anything. I got caught up in something. I got caught up in something too. It's called our job. Get off your high horse. I'm late just this one time and you milk it. At least tell me we're good to go. Of course we are, because I'm competent. He also kind of like, seems like a jerk. Your helmet's on the couch. Chop, chop. Uh, my helmet? What? I don't... Uh... Okay. Uh, no, not yet. I don't know what that means. My helmet's on the couch. Uh... Which couch? I don't think there's an actual, let's see, painting of a lighthouse by the cliffside. That is the very lighthouse we went in. Go here. Painting of a woman holding something yellow and blue. I wonder if that's a rabbit. Could be. Items. Oh, yeah, they don't show a picture of it, but it's a yellow and blue rabbit. Okay. Let's go here. Painting of an animal. Of some sort. Looks like it's a platypus. A casual painting of three people. I can't get that. That's not. I thought to get something on the floor. Okay, so I have to get a helmet. I'm not sure where that helmet is. They sit on the couch, so I guess that's downstairs. I didn't know they DHED Eva. Hmm. Where's my helmet? <laughs> Your helmet's on the couch. Chop, chop. I don't... <sighs> I'm 
confused where the couch is. <laughs> I genuinely am. I don't, I don't see a couch, and if I try to leave the room, um, can I, I can't change the. Yeah, I can't. Okay, so I can't change the. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, I can, I can move using. Okay, the arrow keys, but not WASD. Okay. Uh, I don't. I'm confused. Uh, okay, whatever. Let's do it. All right. Here we go. Okay, that was that was what was a little confusing, but okay. Okay, let's see what this looks like. Ooh. Gosh. Oh. What's Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, so now we're in this VR thing. And let's see. This should be the last accessible memory. Oh, they're looking at his memories. Okay. Disable speech for all except Johnny. Done. Let's get him. Anytime you view, anytime you can do your position in time by moving the mouse towards the top of the screen. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's oh cool. So that, oh, so that's when he's a little kid, and that's when he's an old man. Okay. Okay. So let's. Uh, so uh, now, what do we just walk around and try to? Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Let's see if we can explore anything. For the river, okay. Oh, Johnny H. Wiles, he wrote that. Okay, that's interesting. That's why I thought I could grab something here. I, did, I, did I miss see that? Hmm. What if we go downstairs? Can we go downstairs? We cannot. That's interesting. Okay, we don't, there's only certain, certain places we can go. Hmm. Okay. I'm not, I'm not sure what we're looking for here. Oh, oh, received note clock. Hmm. Okay. Uh, notes. The clocks in Johnny's house never tick. That's interesting. I wonder why that is. That's strange. Okay, so we can't go into the bathroom. We can't really... Oh, we can't go down here. Okay. Hmm. Okay. I'm unclear what we're looking for, but that's okay. We'll go downstairs. Let's, 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 pull, let's pull this back a little bit here. Hey, come here. How do we... Oh, uh, arrow? Nope. <laughs> I don't remember how they said to move a duck on it. <laughs> nope. Is it... Nope. Wasdy? Nope. Click doesn't work. Dragging it doesn't work. Hmm. All right, well, whatever. Can, we can't go outside. Oh, wait, maybe we can go out this way. Oh, we can. Okay, great. Hmm. Let's see what's over here. We haven't really looked over here much. Oh. <gasps> okay, who's this? Oh, is that, is that Johnny and his wife? Oh, we can talk to him. Oh, that's great. What a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. My name is Dr. Eva Roseland, and this is Dr. Von Matterhorn. Dr. Lorenzo Von Matterhorn. Hmm. Dr. Neil Watts. Hmm. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? Oh, are you two from the agency? How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, 
get us some tea, please. Hmm? Lily? Actually, you've already called us. What? <gasps> We're here to fulfill our contract from the relative future. <gasps> Careful there. If you slip off the cliff, we're going to have to reload this memory. Watch it, Neil. Show some respect. Yeah, it's just a program, you know. I know, but this is the last acceptable memory. We need his cooperation. Worst comes to worst, we can just reboot it. Why would you stop wasting time like that? You. It would be a little bit difficult to understand. You're here to take me to the moon, aren't you? Oh. Yes, John. Oh. Hmm. I suppose they had a good run. Not good enough, it seems. So, can you do it? Can you take me to the moon? We can't. But you might be able to. Why do you want to go there? I don't know. <laughs> it's fine. You can tell us. It's essential for us helping you, helping you to, to go there, to get you to go there. Do you want the fame? The money? You've got to have a motive. I'm sorry, but I really don't know. I just do. I can already tell that this is going to be a pain in the ass. Nevertheless, Johnny, here's what we will do. We need to get to your childhood, but it's too distant to do so in one memory hop. Thus, we will need to traverse through your memories with gradual backward leaps, which you've given us permission to do in the relative future. Once we lay down the waypoints in your childhood memories for direct access, then we will return here. That's when you'll need to help us influence the childhood to, to become an astronaut. Or to get a giant catapult. The point is, you'll need to have more to say. Well, the point is, you'll need to have more to say than just, I don't know. As long as you can take me to the moon, I will cooperate in any way possible. Good. Now, in order to leap into memory, we need an item that is of, we need an item that is of importance to you. Do you have a memento of some sort to get us started? Hmm. Oh, with the bunny we took before. Well, shall we? Ladies first. Okay, let's, let's get it. Received. Received note. Moon. All right, let's... Uh, we'll need to prepare this memento first. Prepare. Oh. Oh, got some code going on there. Complete the memo. Click the orbs to flip pieces. What? Okay. Uh, I'm confused. What is going on here? Oh, I see. Okay. Okay, pretty, okay, pretty basic, simple puzzle. I'm assuming they're starting off very simple. It'll get more difficult. I will say that people have said that um, the puzzles here are, are not particularly challenging, but that's okay. The memento can now be activated for traversal. Okay. Uh, items. Room key, toy platinum, paper rabbit. Objective, clock. Okay, I guess. Hmm. Okay, I'm not sure how I do that. Oh, I see. Go. There we go. Activate meadow. Activate. Wait. What about my privacy? Oh, this is big tech. You don't have any privacy. We'll try not to violate what we can avoid. 
<laughs> but in most cases, it can't be helped. Also, don't be evil. Oh, there they go. Ooh. Oh, bunny. Okay. Here we are. Oh, there's the platypus. Wow, we've got bunnies all over the house. Okay, we're a little bit, a little bit back. Great. Turn off visibility and interactivity. It'd be messy to be seen. Yeah, yeah, happy? Okay. Jeez, what's with all these rabbits? This is creeping me out. We probably should have checked his record for psychopathy first. <laughs> oh, huh? Like, what the? Did he hear me? That's impossible. Probably just a part of this memory. Hmm. Then I stand by my point. Anyway, quit blabbering to find him a minute to, to hop from here. Okay, let's find a memento. Uh, this one? I think this rabbit. Multicolored paper rabbit. Why aren't you special? Having two colors when all your siblings look like they drowned in bleach. What's that? You think you're really creepy? Why, yes. I agree. Okay. Oh, good. So we're gonna need... Okay, we're gonna need several. So, got it. Uh, let's get the... Can we get the platypus? We cannot. Okay, well, let's look around here. What else do we got here? Let's try upstairs. Upstairs? Nope, upstairs. Okay. The clock is moving, but soundless. Oh, wow, okay, cool. Oh, he's up here too, okay. An old patched up backpack. What is this? A million years old? I guess we'll find out. An old patched up backpack. Did that? No, that didn't work. What about this? A bottle of pickled olives. Mm. Pfft, I hate this stuff. What's the hate? It's pickled olive. Exactly. Let's go over here and see what's over here in the bookshelf. A selection of reading from medical journals. Yeah, nothing special there. What about this? The Emperor's New Clothes by Hans Christian Andersen. There we go. We got one more to go. And this one didn't do anything? Yes, it didn't. Can we, yeah, we can't open it, can we? That's fine. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. I didn't, I didn't see that here. Let's go down here. Fresh wildflowers. Got it. We got it. Okay. Uh, wait. Memory links established. Okay, good. Now you can travel with the memento. Oh, the umbrella. Okay, got it. We need to go get the umbrella. Okay, there we go. Let's travel. Nope. Nope, hold on. Got it. Oh, I see. I have to put all of them in there. Got it. Okay. Hadouken. <laughs> what the? What's that? What? That's it. I'm doing the breaking from now on. Let's go. Memento. Let's go. Back we go. More computer code. Wait, what? Did prompt said slap twice in the river. I can't see what that says. Um, reminder. The corner orb can flip the entire diagonal. Okay, that's okay. Uh. Oh, I see. Blink. Got it. Okay, now we can go. 
activate the memento. Okay, so that's a pretty basic puzzle, but it's pretty fun. I can see how that could get more complicated, to be sure. Okay, so now he's outside with a little platypus. We're back a little bit further. And we're back in this memory. When it comes to rain, though, this is better than onto. I'll mind it regardless. Sounds like these memory hops only span a short period of time. We need to find a leaping memento, or it's going to take forever. Man, just enjoy the scenery. Well, I think we'll find out what we're supposed to do here next time. Hey, thanks for watching this playthrough of To the Moon. It's definitely turning out to be a very, very interesting narrative-driven game. Thanks again, and see you next time.